Oh, fancy seeing you here. If you just left the last video, I'm back already, right? Hey everybody, my name is Justin. This is The Tall Guy Gamer, and we are playing Death's Door, otherwise known as super adorable crow game um, with a dark turn of reaping souls and being murdered. So anyway, so far it is a delightful little game. I'm having a blast honestly playing it, and it's a very, I guess we'll call it Zelda-like so far. Uh, I've just got my butt kicked a couple times, so that's kind of a good thing, though, because the game was really easy at first. And now we're going to go talk to the Urn Witch. Well, I shouldn't say talk to her. Apparently, I've been sent on a mission to murder her, but I don't even know if she's, like, a bad person. I mean, it looks like she gives people... I just... I wonder how long that has been muted. <laughs> there, there might be some clever editing in this video because apparently at some point I hit my microphone and I've been muted and for God knows how long. Seriously, could have been a long time. Could have been since the last video. Holy shit. I bet it was since the last video. That makes me feel rather stupid. Oh, is that a key? All right, it was one. All right, so there's more to do. And like, I could go under that table. This is a charge up sword. Nope. I thought maybe the charge up blade would uh, swing higher or lower. What a kick in the dick that I accidentally muted that microphone goes to show you a capacitive touch button for mute is not always to your benefit I might have said some really cool stuff too while I was muted I don't even know I can't remember and I can't recover the audio if it was muted it was muted it's gone nuggets of wisdom forever denied to the viewers a tragedy I say You might be thinking, thank God. See, I told you I could use fire to open these. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Uh, okay. Let's shoot this way. That way, one up here, there is. I bow even shoot that far? I guess it will. I thought there was a range limit at some point, but oh, I see the uh, regenerating urns. Make sure that I have arrows to shoot. Makes sense. Aw, oh, crap. Oh! Wasn't quite what I expected to come out of there. Oh, I can break his guard. Good to bite me. Or how bad that is supposed to hurt him. It seemed to do much to him. Looks like some of the guys definitely have maybe oh it looks like maybe this is the only thing that really hurts them 
Can't tell. Like, my sword doesn't seem to be doing much there. Oh, I, I can hurt his tongue. I see. The rest of his body uh, didn't seem to be affected by my sword swings. Well, now I can't wait to review the footage later and see how much I uh, muted myself out of my conversation with you guys. What the heck? The bird soul? It appears we have been abandoned here. I don't think anyone is coming to open the door. What? What does that mean? I'm here. That's it? Like, one little bird door soul? Oh! Witch of Urns! Hello, dear. Quite expected to see a crow around this place. Does this mean the deal is off? What brings an adorable fellow like you into my little house? What does that mean? Hold you. Conspiracy. She has a conspiracy with another crow or something like that to be immortal or something. Oh! I don't know if I was supposed to hit her, but I did. I just whacked her without even thinking about it. Hey, pothead. Hmm, this door looks rather out of place, as if it were from another world. It actually looks a little like you, big face. But perhaps a trifle more imposing. I'm trying to say, man. Oh. Oh. I guess I did have a, key, a yellow key, didn't I? Wow, that guy just kamikaze himself right into the wall. Uh. Oh, really? Uh, okay, I guess I gotta go do it from here. Ooh, there's a... Upgrade thing. Down there. Oh, I fell. Well, let's go back up again. Okay, we can get this urn over here. And then if I drop off of this one, I should be able to shoot that. Can I walk back here? Oh, I can. Sweet. That large soul. I feel like the speed upgrade thing I got must be very minimal, right? Because I don't, I don't feel a whole lot faster on the the rolling. I mean, it's probably not supposed to be a huge upgrade right away, right? Who else is over here potting around? I hear you. I think I don't. Oh, here he is. A really creepy, uh, oh, oh, Lumiere. Except for he's made of shadow. This is the one that spits out the green guys. You dead? Hmm, okay, we got a seed there, so we definitely want to get that. Building up a little stockpile, I think. Got a couple already, right? Yeah, number three. I don't know if there's a reason to stockpile them. That's me getting excited for. Maybe no reason. Unlocked. I, the, the puzzles in this game are like deceptively like simple, but they're really satisfying, I guess. Maybe it's because I'm used to games with very hard puzzles and sometimes you start you start to get frustrated. I guess I feel good that they're Simple enough to quickly solve. Gotta burn that, obviously, so we can get to that ladder. Can't get to the ladder. How do we burn it? Mind. There's a ladder right here. And this one. Is there anything to do here? Is there something I can't see correctly? Oh, here we go. Oh, what? Oh, there we go. It did work. But what's that ladder for if I could just light it from there? Okay, never mind. Looks like the ladder is on the way up here. 
but the way I did that was to get the key and then the ladder was so I could climb this pull this lever oh, I'm sorry push the lever I'm not pulling any levers here I think that's worth it yet still right I don't, oh oh no is there gonna be two of nope he's just being mixed with other dudes Oh, come on. Come on, get out of the way. Uh... I feel like that smash attack should be a little bit stronger than it is. Oh. That was a misfire. Can't see this dude whenever he's not facing me. Like, give me something to work with, guy. All right, he's dead. Look out. Whew. All right. You know, I haven't tried the umbrella yet, but... I still don't see a reason to use the umbrella. Seems like a trick. She said I would live forever, but with a pot for a head, no thanks. Dang, there's four of these? That's gonna take me forever. Sit up. Bad posture. Oh, now, now I got a microphone in my face again. Okay. At least, you know, maybe I should have the microphone in my face. I won't accidentally have myself on mute. Downside to record. Oh, heavens, my house is a mess. My beautiful urns shattered. Ahem. I mean, I must apologize for the state of the house, dearie. I wasn't expecting guest. Yeah, but I'm gonna whack it. Oh, did you see that? You do like a, a dive bomb attack. Ooh, that's cool. I lost my train of thought. I don't know what I was going to say a minute ago. I was saying something very clever, probably, about me not recording myself earlier. Oh, I was going to say, that's, that's the downside of recording over streaming, right? Streaming, at least somebody could have said in chat, hey, you idiot, your microphone's off. Instead, I'm just all by myself here, being a moron, without anybody to tell me that I'm being a moron. Hmm. Think you're clever, do you? Oh no. Oh. Gang it up. Jeez. Oh, I thought that would be more impressive than it was. Oh, crap. Crap. Okay. Look out, look out. We need to go use a seed, I think. Get another one right here. What's happening? All right. Um, was there a place to use one of these seeds out here? Let's go check. Because I'm hurting. Certainly hurting. Well, do I even have to use a seed? What happens if I go in here? I think I get my health back if I go in the door. But does it like respawn enemies? And how many souls do I have? Oh, I don't have enough for another upgrade, so never mind. Let's see what happened. Let's see if anybody's respawned. Well, of course, there's no regular bad guys out here. So I guess I couldn't tell anyway. You guys respawn? Yeah, they did, didn't they? But it doesn't matter. I've already opened the door, so I don't care. Uh, why does this look like deceptive? B? 
be simple. Waiting for something to like attack me. No, yes. Nothing attacked me. Okay. I'll take it. There's gotta be a reason for Smith. That's the first box that's had anything in it. This lady, why is she complaining about her urns? They all put themselves back together. I haven't really broken anything. It's not permanently. Look out! That guy's crazy. Ooh, Biff bag. Yeah. But that it. Yeah. Can't talk. Big bath tub. I have a big bathtub in my house. Guess what? I can't fill it. Hot water heater runs out. What the heck? What was that? I'm confused. I guess I see it in that reflection. Okay, there we go. Oh, that's crazy. Look at the floor, guys. I mean, that was that was basically an accident, the first one I discovered, and then I realized that the reflection had something. Oh, hello, bird god. With horns. The ancient shrine offers you a shard from a magic crystal. Collecting four will raise your magic capacity beyond its limits. All right, so I've got one of each. Can really use some more. Yeah, you see the reflection on the floor, and the po I can see only see the pots and the reflection. That's kind of cool. Like I said, I'm not gonna lie and say I noticed it before because I didn't. But now that I know it's there, very cool. What is this? Uh oh. 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 You don't say. Nice little shortcut back to where, uh, back up here, I guess I should say. Don't go down there yet. I'm scared if I go down there, there's going to be a fight. It looks pretty fighty, right? Like there, if there was ever an arena for a fight, that's it. And it looks like it's against a giant pot. And that creeps me out because that's not normal. I'm telling you, I've said it on like every series I've played so far, guys. Game developers have either A, terrible nightmares, or B, they're high when they come up with some of this stuff. I don't mean to judge, I'm saying. I love video games, I love the ideas these guys come up with, but you don't think of this stuff unless, you know, you're wigging out in some sense. And I've had some creepy nightmares in my day, so I know your nightmares can do some weird stuff. I wish I had more awesome dreams that I could remember. I remember having a dream one time. This is really weird and off kilter, but like me and my dad, who both, by the way, are not like trained fighters or killers in any means. But in this dream, for some reason, oh, I just killed myself. In this dream, we like, first of all, someone was trying to kill us. But for some reason or another, me and my dad, we were like trained like killers too. Like we knew how to like kill, you know, whether whether that's like ex-assassins or something, I don't know. But we knew what we were doing to fight back against these guys. It was weird. It was uh, it was very interesting though. Did I just get some kind of achievement or something? I think I did. I got six seeds on me. I'm gonna go ahead and plant one. I wish I knew if there is a limit. Like I said, is there, is there a one-to-one -one ratio of seed and pot in the game? Or am I potentially leaving the, some pots never utilized if I don't put seeds in them? Or You see what I'm saying? You guys know what I'm saying. You get it. At least one of you gets it. One of you might be dumb. I don't know. Just kidding. Oh, I got shot. All right. These particular guys are kind of annoying while you're trying to fight this guy, which is obviously the idea. Doesn't mean I have to like it. 
And you know, the idea is nice, like shoot or kill these guys and clear them out, but they just come right back. I almost walked right into that. Ooh, that was close. Oh, he's dead? Oh, no, he's not dead. Thought I killed him. Now he's dead. All right, good deal. You guys are pretty easy if you uh, get up on them and don't let them have time to shoot at you. One more bird soul. I feel like there was four, though, right? I'm starting to question the authority of our Lord of Doors, although it might be a bit late given that I am deceased. See, there's some shenanigans going on here in Crow World. Where am I missing this one at? Is there, a, is there an obvious door I didn't go in? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is this a, a way to go? Oh. Nope. What is not? All right, where's the lady? She's going to be out here somewhere. Planning. Oh, there she is. Oh, goodness. You're not the cause of all this ruckus, are you? I would not be very hospitable to any beast who would mistreat my children. Tread lightly, a reaper. Well, you know it's me then. How about a shot to the face? Oh, I didn't do nothing. Now, is any damage I'm doing to her now going to be inflicted upon her later in our inevitable fight to the death? I don't know. But I hope it is. Okay, back. I guess we'll go this way. This is the way I didn't go earlier because I thought it was going to be my my doom. Oh, oh, he talks. Shall we dance? Oh, crap. Oh! All right, all right. I see what you're playing with. Come at me! Oh! Oh no, I'm stuck! Oh, I'm stuck! Oh! I'm stuck! Mother! I didn't know that I'd be stuck underneath that golden... I don't know what the hell that thing is. It looks like a chandelier or something, which I thought was hanging from the ceiling. Apparently it's not. It's just sitting right there on the floor where it will trap you if you get too close to it. Hothead, man. Help me out. How goes the exploration, my friend? mansion is dark and full of strange creatures. Please stay vigilant. I haven't made a new companion in a great many years, so I do hope we survive our first adventure together. Well, you know what? I'd be doing better if you helped me out, man. Just a little bit of help. That's all I'm asking. I just got my teeth kicked in by a dancing pot because you weren't around to help. And because the chandelier conspired to trap me. Should be able to get back here pretty quick, though, I think. Yeah, it's just right through here. Look out for the kamikaze pot. He's coming. All right, this one. Now don't. Yeah, yeah, I know. Shall we dance? Sure. Just don't go down there and get trapped by the other house ornament. Can't tell if I hit him or not. Oh, I hit him there. Oh, no, I stayed too close. Too close to the sun. All right, so basically he just wants to get close to you. And he goes, and then he goes spinning. So like he'll hop all day, I think, right now until he gets close to me. So let's charge up a big hit. Oh, no. He didn't get close enough. Stupid move. Get out of there. hits can this guy take oh all right maybe we'll try the rolling hit next time nope that didn't work either yeah that golden thing down there whatever the heck that is i mean maybe i'm an idiot i, I can't tell what that is what, what does this look like to you guys it looks like a chandelier that has fallen from the ceiling i guess or maybe like a sideways like mounted to the wall chandelier? I don't know. All I know is it trapped me, and I think it's stupid. <laughs> it killed me. 
and it's dumb. See, it looks like that chandelier right there, hanging from that ceiling. I ain't crazy. I ain't crazy at all. I think it's crazy that it was used to trap me where I couldn't move, and that guy got to kill me. That was stupid. Now, wait a minute here. Hold on. Okay, let's get the seed. There's some tricksy going on here. Look at that. Oh, crap. I wasn't even paying attention. There's a bracelet or something over there. You see it? The power bracelet. That's what I'm going to call it. Really, this guy? Now, if I fall... Oh, I'm falling. But I'm a bird, so I'm okay. Is that enemy going to follow me down here? Oh, I see. I can fall onto the chandelier maybe and get that. I thought maybe I'd have to cut it down. Or maybe I do have to cut it down. Let's see. Oh, I did. Okay, cool. Down with that. Hey, guy, come over here where I can hit you with my sword. Uh-huh. That was a trick. Oh, he got away. Oh. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Sweet. Oh, I can afford another upgrade. Another skill upgrade. Kill this guy just for the principle of it, but he's being rude and not letting me get him. There go. Anyway, I don't think I can get over there, can I? Oh man, it kills me. I want that bracelet. Whatever it is. I don't even know. Oh wait, maybe I I, I didn't even, <laughs> I like I'm not even paying attention to the fact that, like, literally there's part of the wall ground I can walk on here. Like, I was only seeing the, the beams as, like, walkable territory. So, never mind. Here's the bracelet. What is this? You found an old engagement ring. Now you just need to find someone who would want to marry you. Aww. Can our little bird get married? I do, Mr. Crow. I do. What do these look... I'm gonna say these look uh, like something I shouldn't break, but can't break them anyway. Yeah, this is some crap over here. There's nothing special. Except for beautiful engagement ring. Okay. Question is, is that extra treasure or is that something I actually needed? Find out later. What is happening here? Surrounded by flying weird dudes. Probably just enough for me to keep my magic arrows flying, right? Well, that was cool. I lit two at once. Stay away from me. I like, I, I like little flying dogs. Take a bite of me. Oh. Oh, crap. I didn't see that coming at first. Why is that guy stuck? Like stuck on the wall or... Oh, crap. They're all just waiting on me now. Oh. No, no. That's a rather long ladder. I don't want to go that way yet, though. I can burn this web, right? I hate when there's more than one way to go. I always feel like I'm missing out. Like, no matter what I do, right? I Like, I'm doing it wrong. No matter what I do. Like, see, there's a complete other ladder over there that would lead me somewhere. I don't know where it's going to take me, but there's obviously a door right here that I'm supposed to go through. <gasps> Decisions! All right, well, never mind. That decision was made really easy by the fact that this is the way to go. And a dead end. Why did the door close? How can we get back? Right, pink screen. Hey, pothead, don't go to that door without me, man. You're gonna get in trouble. Oh, well now, little crow, you have well and truly outstayed your welcome. 
First you'd lead my daft grandson astray, filling that head of his with nonsense ideas about curses. That's her grandson? I didn't do nothing. And then you come in here and smash up all my beautiful urns. I'm just trying to help people. Set foot in my basement, there will be consequences. I might even have words with your employer. Although, I'd rather not see that old weirdo again. I mean, a lock for a head? It's so strange. What? Off with you, little crow! What does that mean? Wah! Give her the... What for? It's kind of grisly, right? Dead bodies and the blood lit 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 littered everywhere. Ooh. Giant soul. Okay. Back to... Wait a minute. What's this way? Shortcut? Shortcut! What's this go to? All of the voids are aglow with unearthly light. Is it unlocked? If only I had a more complete understanding of doors. Before you proceed, big face, I have a confession to make. The old witch of this house, she is my grandmother. She cursed me with a ceramic cranium in a misguided effort to make me immortal. See, she was stricken with grief when my grandfather passed, made it her mission to keep our whole family alive forever. Her research led her to believe that replacing one's head with an urn would somehow strike you from death's ledgers. However, I resisted, and during the struggle her spell must have gone awry, for as you can see, I have a pot for a head. I fear she has gone too far beyond her years, and her soul has swollen and grown corrupted. I have seen it happen in this land many times. As a reaper, I implore you to end her suffering and bring her soul into the next life. Perhaps she can find peace once again. All right, all right. Well, first, we are going back home to upgrade our skill. Definitely have to explore this area. After I kill this witch, I'm going to have to explore the old hall of doors here. See who's what. Somebody's yanking my, my feathers. Hmm. Oh, we could even do a level two of some of this stuff. Interesting, interesting. Melee range increases the attack speed. Uh, we'll just stick with the basics. We'll get a level one of everything going first. Lay a base. Lay a base. Okay. That bird down there, he's going to get lung cancer. We'll just watch and wait for that. Okay, we'll call this part right here. Uh, thank, thank you, everybody, for watching. If, uh, if you have any comments for me, please leave them below. If you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more of this stuff, then subscribe. If you didn't like it and you don't like me, give me a thumbs down and have a blessed day. But no matter what, guys, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching. I really do appreciate it. And uh, thank you for hanging out. And I'll see you next time.